Okay, welcome back everyone and in today's video, we are going to deep dive into something incredible powerful, which is the 10 commandments of transformation. As I mentioned in my previous video, these are the fundamental principles that can drive a significant change in your life. Now, why is it so important to follow these 10 commandments? Well, whether you are looking to shift your mindset, upgrade your habits, or completely reshape your life trajectory, these commandments are designed to guide you through that transformative journey. Now, remember to stay until the end of this video as I'm going to deep dive into each commandment in detail and also discuss how to apply them to achieve a long-lasting and profound change in your life. So let's get started. The first commandment is make no excuses and take full responsibility for your own actions. You see, an excuse is a well-planned lie. If you are really serious about changing your life, you have to start to take full responsibility for yourself. Because nobody in this world can help you until you help yourself first. Remember, we can either make progress or make excuses, but we can't do both. So start taking full responsibility for your own actions today. Second commandment, focus only on yourself by staying committed and disciplined to transform your life. You see, many people often get distracted by all those things that are not important to them. In the end, they wasted their precious time and accomplished nothing in life. Now, I want you to understand this concept. Focus is where your attention goes. So wherever your attention goes, your energy follows and your result will show. And if you happen to lose your focus sometimes, Always remind yourself about the why you need to make a transformation. Okay, the third commandment. Make quick decisions to prioritize what's important to you. Many people believe that they need to find a balance first before initiating any changes in their lives. However, in reality, you will never find a perfect balance because true transformation begins with a decisive commitment to setting priorities and establishing boundaries. So make a decision today to prioritize what's really important to you. Okay, next, the fourth commandment. View mistakes as lessons to learn and wisdom to gain, not as failures. You see, many people often view mistakes as failures, leading them to abandon their efforts after one unsuccessful attempt. However, the essence of progress lies in shifting our perspective. Therefore, I always believe in reframing failures as experiments. Each one teaches us what works and what doesn't, providing invaluable wisdom and guiding our next steps. So remember this, always treat your mistakes as a mentor, learning from them to improve and refining your approach until you reach a successful outcome. Okay, next, the fifth commandment. Recognize every problem as an opportunity to grow and develop. To effectively tackle life challenges, we must learn to shift our perspective. It's all about how you frame your experiences. Often, the problems we face stem from a lack of self-awareness. By understanding ourselves better, we can identify what we truly need. I want you to think of challenges as a stepping stone towards greater achievements. Each hurdle is a chance to test your resilience and creativity. And also, you need to start to cultivate a growth mindset that views each challenge as an opportunity for you to grow and develop yourself. Next, the sixth commandment. Take action to reinforce your self-beliefs and self-confidence rather than just thinking, planning, or talking. You see, if you want to become someone in the future, you need to act first before you can become one. A lot of people spend too much time waiting and planning for the right moment before they even kickstart their action. And in the end, they suffered from analysis paralysis, leaving them feel frustrated with their lives. The key is to start with small actions first to create momentum. And over a period of time, these small actions can develop into long-lasting habits. As you begin to observe some success in your outcome, you will strengthen your self-belief and boost your self-confidence in your life. Next, the seventh commandment. Be patient with your results but impatient with your growth. Have you ever found yourselves always seeking for instant gratification instead of long-lasting growth? You see, this is a common trap, especially in today's fast-paced world. Setting too high expectations can put too much pressure on you, especially for things that are out of your control. In reality, true progress is a marathon, not a sprint. Therefore, you should be patient with your results, but impatient with your efforts towards growth. Next, the eighth commandment. Value your hard work and cherish your growth journey 
rather than pursuing immediate rewards. A lot of times when people are chasing their goals, they always forget about something very important. That is to appreciate how hard they have worked. When you are too caught up with what you want to achieve, you might not notice how far you have grown. Therefore, you have to start making a point to celebrate every progress in your milestones and always be proud of what you have accomplished. Doing this not only make you feel good, but it also keep you motivated to continue achieving your goal. Next, the ninth commandment. Detach from the outcome and be proud of the progress you make towards your milestones each day. These ideas is inspired by Buddhist teachings whereby no matter what you do, you should never attach to the outcome. You just need to focus on getting a little better each day. Even 1% improvement is something you should be proud of and worth celebrating. As you enjoy what you do each day, it makes your journey more fulfilling regardless of the destination. And always remember that every day brings new challenges and opportunities for you to learn, to develop and to grow. And that will enhance your daily progress. Okay, here is the last commandment. Focus on what you can control instead of what is beyond your control. Many people often dwell on their past or worry about their future missing out on opportunities in the present that shape their future selves. And the fact is, the past is already behind us. And the only thing we can do is to learn from the past. Rather than stressing over the future, you should start to focus on building a connection with your future self by taking meaningful action in the present. This will empower you to make deliberate choices today that possibly impact your future, helping you cultivate a sense of purpose and taking control over your life. Okay, there you have it, the 10 commandments of breakthrough transformation. If you want to explore each one in detail, I've put a link in the description below so that you can download the guide. By embracing these 10 commandments, I guarantee you will start experiencing profound changes in your life. In addition to these commandments, I want to share the three meta beliefs of transformation that has personally helped me to stay committed to my journey, even when facing the toughest challenges. In my next video, we will dive deep into the three meta beliefs of transformation, which serve as the driving forces of long-lasting change. So remember to stay tuned for my next video and I'll see you there.